Don't forget to get a permit on your water heater, ladies and gentlemen. Otherwise, you will not be able to rent or sell your home. I had a lot of people who were fighting me on a video about permits on water heaters saying they can't possibly keep track of all the water heaters that are installed. Yeah, they can. It's called a permit. They got they got permits for everything. They can keep track of everything. Decks, bathrooms, HVAC systems, electrical panels. That's what the permits are for. And it's pretty easy to tell if you have a water heater from 2015 and there was no permit opened in 2015 or any later years that there's no permit on that water heater. And they would find all of this out during a CO. You know, the thing where they come and check your smoke alarms and shit. It's actually pretty common. So common that I actually sell a service where I certify permits. And if the water heater's up to code, I just go out, certify the permit, file it. Customer pays for the permits to the township, and then the inspector comes out and inspects. If it's not up to code, then I have to bring it up to code, which means an additional charge. So we see, we got a bond wire, we got a four-inch flue. I didn't change that valve because that's still up to code. We got a new relief valve discharge.